of the Wednesday, the hump day edition of Spotting TPA. Hey, we got rain in the area. Light winds out of the south. Southern operations. I'll sit back, relax for the next 35, 40 minutes. Enjoy the aviation action. Thanks for being here. Twenty ninety-eight. Three hours forty-five minutes ago. Frontier departed. Viva Viva Las Vegas. Yeah. A three twenty service. Landing one nine or right. And it looks like starting tomorrow, TPA will be closing the east side. One right, 19 left for about two weeks. Bah humbug, huh? They've got a drainage problem that they're constructing and are working on. Always making things better. Tomorrow, we're off to a Supra Surprise, surprise, airport. Who won money? Raise their hand. Uh, get them up. Uh, two. How many broke even? Whoa, only one. How many lost money while they were in Vivo, Las Vegas? 126. Isn't that amazing that I can count that fast? <laughs> but they all had a good time. Hey, 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 it's 1802 to Phoenix. Go west, young man. It's one of their new A321 Neos. Six seven service to Cincinnati's Northern Kentucky Airport. Giant Air running for Prime Air.
81 all the way from Fort Lauderdale. Well, it takes about three and a half hours or so to drive there. About 35 minutes to fly here. So they must have departed about 6.30, I'm gonna guess. You can get here before 7 a.m. on a Southwest flight. coming to see me. Fox News 13. Super thanks, super shout out time here at TPA. Super thanks, super shout out to Kevin Peters. Kevin, my friend, thank you for supporting the channel once again. If you'd like to support the channel like Kevin, please check out the super thanks icon. And if you haven't done so already, hopefully you'll take a moment, smash that subscribe button, like, share, hit the notification bell, ding, ding, yeah, uploads daily. You don't want to miss a single episode. And again, if you'd like to support the channel like Kevin, Check out the super thanks icon. Back we go to the aviation action. Oh, I love this time of day. Beacons, beacons everywhere. Oh my God, oh crap. Oh no. Oh, no, I'm in big trouble. All right, I gotta hide. I gotta hide. It's Rosie the River Otter. My ex. This is not good. This is not good at all. I gotta hide. I gotta hide. Salt Lake City. 1255A, they're running the 737-900 there now. Changes of planes, just times, departures. Ironically, they were all earlier, and of course, we're arriving earlier. Fourteen thirty to Boston to Logan, Bean Town. Ooh. Got an exec 
exec jet. That exec jet on this side, that's telling me nothing's happening on the east side, so they closed it already, I guess. Well, Ryan from uh, Fox News 13 just introduced himself. He's gonna get the cameras out here in a minute, Let's get set up, and talk to this guy. Oh, oh, oh. being pushed over to air side E. Can you tell I'm a little partial to my 757 rocket ships? Oh yeah. Hey. Boy, get darker later every day. Ooh, smoke it up. Smoke it. Oh, how do you not love that beast? And what do you guys think? Delta ordered 100 737 MAX 10s, which will basically be replacing our rocket ship. <laughs> I'm in mourning. Yeah, Ed Bastion, CEO of Delta. He said it was a no-go on letting me use the uh, tug to push around some aircraft. He said it's a highly skilled position and I don't have those positions. I don't have those skills to be pushing around his billion dollar aircraft. And he's probably got a valid point. United. <laughs> what else can I tell you? Other than WOS. Yeah, they're telling me 2 9 3 Carol, 1 9 right, clear for takeoff. 9 right, clear for takeoff, 9 right, clear for takeoff. Yeah, they're 10-12, contact the push. 9 right, clear for takeoff, clear for getting. 22-93! You sound like a football player. 22-93! Put, put, put! We're on the way to Houston. Back-to-back -back UAs. Oh, it's starting to spritz. Spritz is kind of like spraining, only more like spitting. Another 7-3, what do you bet? Well, you know where this is going. I'd be shocked if it goes anyplace else, but the wall of shame. Not even cool. Jeez. <laughs> Oh 
Oh yeah. 775, the new A321 Neo TPA to LAX. The paparazzi special. Notice how the front end of the first class is bulging. It's throbbing, it's filled with movie stars. Could be Jennifer Aniston, game show hosts, YouTubers, wrestlers, real estate agents, haters, influencers. It's influencers, easy for me to say. At five and a half hours, I'll be shopping Rodale Drive, up to Malibu for a little light lunch. Back down to the Beverly Hills Hotel for dining, cocktails, and dancing. And maybe off to the hot tub. Tomorrow, rinse and repeat. If you listen carefully, you'll hear the champagne corks popping. Now, it is required that you do wear sunglasses, though, if you are in this uh, special. 775 has been clear for takeoff, one nine or right. and spirit in the sky, Norman Greenbaum from the Motor City, Detroit. Oh, there's Alaska, the latte, the coffee shop special, headed to Seattle, Tacoma. Uh, left 
The 471 studio to ground. Here she comes. Good morning. Good Oh, there she goes. <laughs> yeah, get out of here, you wicked witch. She's always got that scowl on her face. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't see me. Whew, that was a close call. She's never happy with me anymore. Rumors are, though, she's dancing these days, learning or going to dance lessons to be a stripper in Las Vegas. Hey, you can't just make this stuff up. 359, the Goose Drag Line. Almost six hours of 737-900 fun. Heard the Pacific Northwest is frozen. It's cold weather. Heard from Mike Perdomo. On Washington. Mike said, yeah, they were like low 40. Thanks for that info there, Mike. Look at that face. Only a mother could love that face. And even that's questionable. Always got a scowl on that face. He missed me, he missed me. Now you gotta kiss me. Oh no. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Nobody gave me a warning about Rosie being here. This could have been bad. Being interviewed on TV today and she could have come up here and kicked my you-know-what. What is with Delta? Ooh, I see rain down there. We got rain coming, kids. Oh yeah, it's special every time in the cafeteria at TPA. That should be Illinois 1. Thank you, Southwest. Two days in a row you gave us something. And it's starting to rain. We gotta get Rosie the hell out of here. Don't let her stay here any longer. She might come back and haunt me. From this angle, she might see me. She knows this is one of my spots. What if I stick my tongue out at her from here, she can see it. Yeah, we were. Well, the drizzle's picking up. To a steady light rain. We've got a busy day today. We've got the spotting show to do today. The interview. Vaccine appointment at 11. Uh, uh, we'll see if that happens. We were canceled the other day after we drove all the way there. Doctor's appointment at 1. Off to Best Buy to pick up some uh, necessary technical equipment. I got all kinds of things going on today. I should be lucky. 
I can do it on my own. <laughs> I'm not stuck with the regular eight to five. Hallelujah. I'm a lucky guy. Why am I complaining? Shut up, Stephen. <laughs> See you, sucker. Oh, look at that look. I think she sees me right now. Oh, 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 oh. looks could kill. I'd be a dead man. Dead man walking. I wonder where she's going. Why do I care where she's going? She can go wherever she wants. Illinois won. It's not going to be the length of your life that matters. It's the quality of We got a big FedEx heavy about ready to take off. And then we'll get right back to the interview. <laughs> We're all excited. We're all plane watchers. News 13. News at 11. Check for Steven. 38. 2631 heavy. Is the FedEx. Oh yeah, spear in the sky. Norman Greenbaum. The school bus. We got a few more survey results on what do you like better, the school bus or the classic livery. And the classic livery continues to win. We've had a number of our uh, viewers ride spirit lately and mixed results. The common one was, I guess, there's no in, in seat, uh, no IFE, no in-flight entertainment, and the seats are rather tight, is what I was told. Oh yeah, it's heavy jet time in the cafeteria, TPA.
guys don't get their shoes. I made the move down to the uh, long-term garage. Look, sick jet action there. I realized I was probably on a setting that wasn't any good the last 25, 30 minutes or half hour. But the interview was fun. Thank you to Ryan and thank you to uh, Fox News 13 here doing a story on plane spotting. I think that's great. It will film a real little hair this weekend, and I'm hoping to get a link when I can share it with you guys. Oh, well, I grabbed an umbrella. Thank you, you're missed at or prior to the first holders in the traffic departing prior to your arrival. That only one runway so I can out have you on the runway. So prior to the first holders. Ooh, we got somebody coming in. Well, we're going to get all these, uh, all the arrivals are going to be over here on one nine right for two weeks. Either that or uh, one left. No east side action. The other runway is closed. Southwest 1165, step aside, runway 1 and right, line up away traffic on a 4 mile final, but they will be breaking off prior to the threshold. That sounds loud, I'm going to turn that down. Uh, 195, Southwest 1, 65. 64, 47, Southwest 30, 30, yeah. Bird, the bird, the bird, the bird. Hey, there's one of our manatee buddies. As we get closer to winter time, the manatees love being here in Tampa Bay. 65 runway 1 and 8, click to take off. Click to take off 1 and 8, stop west 11, 65. Southwest 11, the king here, north and south line, west of here, I was 1600 feet off the advisor, about 6 north of the field. 1600 feet. Southwest 34, 56, runway 1 and a right, clear for takeoff. Take off 1 and a right, southwest 34. Line up and wait. Line up and wait, 1 and a right, watch you, 1 and a right. Number 0 Fox, thank you, thank you so much for that help. Contact Tampa Departure, 119.9 or have a great day. 9, 0 8, 0 Fox, thank you. Ooh, a little condo action there, kids. Got the umbrella out. So if you hear any tapping, <laughs> that's just raindrops keep falling on my head. Foxy Moxie, 138. Airbus. Hey, some of these new A22300s that they have are now a year old. Boy, it's hard to believe these came out a year ago already. Feels like yesterday. 
You know, I think as I get older, everything feels like yesterday. Oh, rocket ship. Hummingbird. We got it all here at TPA. TPA stands for the perfect airport. One thing they brought up during the uh, interview was uh, asking about how Tampa International is with plane spotters. Well, if you're in these garages here, they have absolutely no problem with you. They encourage them. They even take trips where they take people out on occasion. Another reason why it's just an ex amazing experience here at Tampa International. Other airports should take a look and see why they win the JD Award Travel Experience Customer Satisfaction Awards. All right, the rain's so light I had to get rid of it. I have my umbrella in one hand, camera in another. I can never get my phone out. Hey, our new phones arrived yesterday. Just waiting for cases to get here. This looks like a minibus. I wonder if this is 1160 from Raleigh Durham. It looks like it's just sitting there. Yes, I got it right. 1160. A319 minibus, short stuff. If it gets the job done, if you know what I mean. <laughs> That's what's going to start happening with only one main runway open. We're going to end up with a lot of inbound traffic, which is going to hold up that outbound traffic. There's 6982 our heavy to Memphis. We got a JetBlue. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. West of you right now, it's a king year. We're going to be doing north and south lines at 1,600 feet. Do it, Roger. 337. Three, the Mile High City, that is Denver. Colorado. 737-900. Low and slow barbecue special. ULP. Uh, Ultra low performance takeoff setting saves on wear and tear in gasoline. Or in this case, aviation jet fuel. Six, nine, two, heavy. Line up and wait. They don't like to wait. Headed home to Memphis, five-year-old 767. There goes our manatee. It was funny. The interviewer knew and found out about the wall of shame. <laughs> These guys must think I'm nuts. Tower, 692, we're ready. I know we're waiting for Silver to get the heck out of the way. The prop job is slow as molasses. Come on, Silver, turn on the way. We've got a heavy to get out of here.
Just the tiniest bit of spray, a little condo in the engines. The rain has been light, light, light. We're going to follow them right through here, side B. Boy, the tower and the captain both sounded, their voice sounded so much alike. Oh, they're up already. This is 226 to Kennedy. Whoa! Kiss my sink, that was awesome. Jet Blue. Emerson, Lake and Palmer, still you turned me on, yeah! I wish I knew that flight crew. 22 thumbs up. Oh yeah, the star of today's show. Airplane wise. It's 889. 757 rocket ship service to ATL. Dorf! Pizzazz Airport! The Lance Hartzell Jackson International Airport. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure this 75 can even keep up with that jet uh, JetBlue that just took off. That was crazy go nuts. or an exec jet or something. That A320 must have been like empty. Oh, they put something in their go-go juice. Nitromethane. <laughs> Running on nitro. Fire those engines. You are Manatee delivery is headed to Denver. Manatees don't want to go to Denver. That's dry and the water there is chilly. They like the Crystal Springs here in Florida. I think he was crying. Dang! That's a wrap on this Wednesday, the hump day. My news interview today here at Tampa International. How fun was that? It's supposed to go up Saturday or Sunday. Hopefully I can get a link that I can share with you guys and send to you and see, show you the story of plane spotting here at Tampa International. Hey, we appreciate appreciate you being on board. If you haven't subscribed yet, hopefully you'll take a moment, smash that subscribe button, like, share, and hit that notification bell as we upload daily. Oh, yeah. You never know where we're going to be from one day to the next. It's Tampa International today. Surprise, surprise, airport tomorrow, Thursday. And if you'd like to support the channel, please check out the Super Thanks icon. 
And as always, we'll see you again tomorrow on another edition of Spotting.